Hello, I bet you wonder what I'm doing with my day today. Well, you see my hat, it's Sunday, it's a yard day, and it is a beautiful day outside. So let's go out and enjoy it. Here's Lizzie's little favorite bush. Look at that. Yeah, I've got lots of flowers to uh, cut to get back. If she was coming home, she'd have almost a dozen flowers that I could put in her room for her. Just off this flower alone. Yeah, we're really having a bloom fest down here. Pretty. Well, you know, we've uh, taken a look at it now before I've uh, cut it back. Let's uh, take a look at what it's going to look like after it's all cleaned up for the week. Okay, here's the bush again. Tidied up a little bit. Looks pretty, huh? This one's going to have this, another one open. I didn't show you this one here, though. Here we go. That's going to open soon. Put that one there. Put that one there. Yeah. This one is just about ready to open. Yeah. When you cut them back, they just keep coming. And look how big the bulbs are getting. This is almost as tall as the, um, then the rose plant is next to. It's quite sweet right there. There's the loquat tree that still needs to be moved. Here's the other one. Isn't that pretty? Then there's something down here for us to look at. Look at this. I don't know if you can see this in the shadow, but there is a nice size zucchini there. Another little one, another little one, another little one, another little one. Yeah, lots of zucchinis. Here's the prickle pear plant with lots of <laughs> grapevines on it. Yeah. Lots of new growth this week. Those are the prickle pears themselves. But Quiet's friend, he likes the leaves. He likes to eat the leaves. We've cooked these before. I don't like them that much because they're kind of slimy. There's some fruit up there. I don't know if you can see the cute little pink flower. And then there's some little grapes coming already. See those? Those cute. Take a look around. There's the loquat tree. It's almost finished. There's lots to do over in this area. Oh, look, there's lots of weeds coming up in my radishes. We're going to try some of these. Look at that. Ooh, and the peas. Got some fat peas back there. And look at all the green beans. Yeah. Got lots of work to do up there, but first I'm uh, working down below. Some more grapevines. Yeah. <laughs> I have to look really careful. I don't want bugs on me here. Here's the uh, persimmon tree. I don't know if you can see some of the little flowers. Yeah. It's full. Just like the uh, guava tree. Pretty little flowers, lots of them. Ah. <laughs> you see all those flowers? Well, I have got to go and weed this part of the yard. So let's do it. I went in for a quick drink and look who's waiting for me when I come out. Yeah. Can you see him? Where is he? Ah, oh, he's moving. There he goes. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, these little guys make me nervous because they move so fast. 
Well, that's enough for the lizard break. Let's get back to work. Here's the lower part of the garden. It's kind of hard to tell the weeds from the green beans, but I will be taking care of that soon. Behind us, there's uh, onions up on the next level here. Lots of weeds in there too. You can see the new roll of green beans there. Then the little tomatoes in the back. Yeah, some of these guys need to be put back in their cage. And then, I think later on we'll go up and take a look at the zucchinis up on top. So, I've got lots to do here in this area. So I guess I'd better get busy. Quiet wanted a quick look at the shallots. There they are. They're starting to turn. I think if he comes tomorrow, he'll be able to pick those. Some of them are still really white. Yeah. Very nice. Oh, there's another lizard. That is how I know when it's time to go in. I start seeing a lot of them. Before I go to water in the front, I want to show you a little bit of what I was doing while <laughs> we were apart. I went to um, Target, had coffee with a friend because they have a Starbucks there. So I had coffee with a friend at Starbucks. I went to Sally's Beauty and uh, where else did I go? I went to Michael's and to get pizza so I don't have to cook tonight because I've got a lot going on. So first, let's take a look at some of the stuff I got. Okay, this is some of the stuff I got from Michael's. I got this and this for School Mother's Day. So we're working on a project with that and I'll show you that later on. This is to finish off the little squares. Remember, I'm doing the blanket again. So um, that's for that. This is to finish off the baby blanket we're working on. And when we finish this baby blanket, we've got another one to start to plan. Well, that's all I have for this week. Thanks for spending some time with me. Bye-bye for now. Bye.